What's up everybody? It's Brian here from Ghani Fit and today what I wanted to share with you was a little topic um, that I was kind of thinking of I wanted to share with you and it might help some of you. Actually it might help everyone that is watching this because everyone deals with this problem and this is using your disadvantages as your advantages and what I mean by this is if you've been following me for a while is that you know that I have been um, I'm a hard gainer and I have trouble gaining muscle. That has been a disadvantage to me, which I could just let, you know, control me and be like, you know what, I'm a hard gainer, I'm never going to work out in my life, I just give up because it takes me longer to gain muscle than other people that go to the gym regularly. Even if I go to the gym four days a week or more, it takes me longer than someone else doing the same thing. But I just stick with it. and. I'm making slow progress but I'm making at least steady progress and I keep going and going rather than just saying you know what it's a dis disadvantage for me I'm gonna quit no I say this is a disadvantage for me how can I use this to help other people that have the same disadvantage as me and better their lives as well as my own if I can get over an advantage a disadvantage for myself and make that thing an advantage what can I do with the things that I already have going for me like even right now, it's nighttime, there's not really many people around. There might be a couple people in the park behind me or something that are hearing me talk to a camera. But you know, it is still pretty hard for me to do. I notice myself looking around every once in a while and kind of like being like paranoid if I'm too loud or something or whatever, if someone hears me and starts laughing or something. And it is a disadvantage. I'm not, I'm still working on being less shy and more outgoing. But you know what, If if I have that story of like, I had all this pressure going against me to not do it and I did it like right now when I started this I was feeling so much resistance and now I'm feeling some resistance still but I'm still feeling pretty good about it it's another disadvantage you know like I mean it takes guts for anyone to do a video I'm not saying it's easy for anyone but there's some there's people that are better at communicating with people and starting conversations and all that and even doing videos in public and that's something that I'm still working on and it's been a big struggle in my life because um, like right now someone just walked by and I totally drew a blank because I was focused on that rather than focusing on the video and that's a perfect example actually the person probably didn't even notice me or if they did notice me they're probably just like whatever I don't care the person just making a video who gives a shit right I let it control me sometimes and I'm like why is it like why is this person whatever walking by and why can't I it's more of why can't I focus on just making the video why am I always distracted by if one person walks by who cares that person didn't even judge me or anything and they're probably like oh that's cool that guy's out in public making a video so that was a perfect example right there of using my disadvantages of this using a disadvantage of mine to my advantage actually for making this video so what are your disadvantages in your life what are some things that you can do to make those disadvantages turn into advantages? Like I saw one guy, he has no limbs at all, like completely no arms, no legs. And this guy's doing public speaking for people, like around the world, getting paid for it, inspiring people and living a happy life. I've seen another guy, I forget, I think he got in a car accident or something. He didn't let it, like he got in a really bad car accident, he couldn't really move his arms or legs I can't remember the whole thing but all I know is it was like he was in a way worse situation than 95% of people out there and this guy ended up building a business online this was like six months ago that I read this um, my dad actually showed it to me he sent me the link to it and this guy was like he had everything going against him and he still started a business I think he travels the world now um, just doing like some online stuff and making money like that and you know what he had an extreme disadvantage but he used that to to his advantage and that's an inspiring story I still remember just because it's cool to hear someone like it's cool to hear anyone make it like that but to hear someone that has all these odds going against him just make it like that using his disadvantages to his advantage I mean that's just insane but anyways um, I hope this video did help you like I said point out some disadvantages that you have and how you can turn those disadvantages into advantages. Maybe you're the same as me with um, social anxiety and gaining muscle, or you know, maybe your advantages, your disadvantages that um, 
you want to be able to run but right now you're a little bit overweight or something and it's even hard for you to just to walk or something I mean that's an extreme case for if you're really overweight watching this I guess that's a really extreme advantage again but maybe you are like extremely overweight and you just have to admit that to yourself and be like you know what that's my disadvantage but I'm gonna use this as my advantage I'm gonna inspire others I'm gonna get in shape I'm gonna inspire others to drop a bunch of fat get in shape live a healthy lifestyle because nobody I mean most people don't want to be living overweight like especially extremely overweight I've been a little bit overweight before like I've talked about in previous videos but it was it was only 25 pounds overweight so it wasn't like totally destroying destroying my life but I mean there's actually another guy that I'm gonna mention here I saw him on Instagram a couple times I think he was like 700 pounds I mean this guy was really big and shout out to this guy too I think he's lost like 200 pounds or something since whenever he started a year or two ago or something I mean just like I mean he's still pretty big but like he's making extreme progress to go lose 200 pounds in a couple of years or maybe even five years whatever it was I mean this dude's making big progress and that's good to see and he's using an extreme disadvantage to his advantage because there's gonna be thousands or millions of people that are inspired by his story I mean seeing a guy like 700 pounds drop that much weight is inspiring to like anyone it's even inspiring to me and um just because it's cool to see people do that and change themselves and look towards having not just changing themselves but also look towards having the opportunity to help other people change as well so anyways look at your disadvantages and how you can turn them into advantages and do this every single morning this is something that I'm definitely gonna start doing more often is looking at how I can like every single morning being like you know what I might be a hard gainer I might not be a uh, that good being like in social interactions and stuff but that doesn't mean that I can't take one step today to get better at each of those things you know like every day I do some form of walking out right now I'm taking a walk I just was like I gotta make this video right now it's scaring me and it's gonna help me out even if nobody walks by it's still gonna help me because I feel like people might be watching me or hear me so it's been a really cool uh, thing to do I'm gonna start doing it way more every morning I'm gonna be thinking of my disadvantages and thinking of how I can use those to better impact myself and the world really cool thing actually to add on to this video as well there's this guy oh my camera doesn't want to zoom in anyways he's back there anyway and he's singing around just he has a song playing and he's singing it right now in the middle of the park there's like maybe 10 people there and this guy's doing that so he's doing something that definitely scares him I I would think scares anyone to do that in public I mean this alone is hard but I mean he's actually singing and I'm scared singing in front of people especially that's something that really scares me in life so I mean you might be able to hear the music right now the water is pretty loud but it's pretty cool to see him do that and just wanted to add that in as a little clip because I think it's gonna really inspire you guys as well so anyways hope you enjoyed Good night.